All right, so check this out. We have another crypto analyst talking about Chainlink, saying that this currency is going to rally 90%. Is he right? We'll talk about it. But here's the article right here from the Daily Hotel. You had an analyst called Michael Van De Pop forecast 90% rally for top 20 Ethereum based altcoin. Now, I'm just going to focus in on Chainlink. He goes into more other altcoins, but my focus on this particular video is Chainlink. So let's break this down. Michael tells his 692,000 followers on Twitter or X that the decentralized Oracle network Chainlink could increase about 90% from its current value. Hmm. Okay, cool. What makes him think that? Here's his tweet right here. And I quote, Chainlink is still stuck in a range, but is likely going to break to the upside. Why? Well, here's his reasons. Has taken the liquidity by the dip to $2.20, multiple tests of resistance, Bitcoin pair bottoming, Ethereum starting to wake up. Seems likely we'll see $25 to $30 in the coming months. And here's his chart. This is Chainlink right here. Now you can see how tight the range is in Chainlink. It's just been traded within a trading range. So what could that possibly mean? There's only two scenarios when you see a market trade within a trading range. Either they are selling within that trading range or the market overall is accumulating or they're buying. If he's looking for Chainlink to break out, then apparently this whole range right here is people buying and he has his target all the way up there around 25 to like 28 dollars look like this is a bullish chart Chainlink has consolidated for months and for us to finally see this market break out of this range yeah i mean you have to agree that the market looks bullish now, he's looking for $25 to $30 in the coming months. I don't know if that's six months. I don't know if that's nine months. I don't know if that's at the end of the year that he's looking for Chainlink to run to those highs. But I do agree with Chainlink being bullish. Let me show you my perspective as to why I think price in Chainlink is bullish. Let me show you my chart. This is our chart right here. We've been tracking Chainlink ever since December 18, 2023 is when I first did this price prediction. And I identified a couple of buy zones. These two areas down here at the bottom are buy zones. This is where I would expect buyers to really step in and support price. They did that here. Okay, on the 3rd of January. And then again on the 8th of January. So just like the buyers who bought Chainlink here back in November, they came in again and said, man, I love this price in Chainlink at $12.85. Let me buy more. Let me buy more. This is a valuable price. I see value right here in this zone. And they neglected. They did not neglect letting price fall below that. That's one reason why Chainlink is bullish. The second reason Chainlink is bullish is because these sell zones that we talked about up here acting as resistance. Sell zone simply means that I'm looking for selling pressure to increase, meaning that I'm, I'm expecting the sellers of the market and chain link to be activated and really try to impact price movement lower. But you can see on yesterday's trading price action right here. What do we get? A push to go up bar those buyers has literally eradicated all of those sellers in these zones so we can get rid of that sell zone we can definitely get rid of this sell zone and then now we can get rid of this sell zone so yeah this marketing chain link is still bullish it's been trading within a range look at this and now it's trying to break out so our last price prediction was only minimal profit. It only came down here to this first buy zone. 
and you guys can see that that's where we had our ultimate TP price 9.22 percent okay so now what we can do is get rid of it and you already know what the price prediction is going to be or at least the direction we're looking for Chainlink to go up okay now he's looking for 25 to 30 dollars we're going to look over here to the left of the chart to identify i want you all to see this though look at this and look at how long the market and chain link was trading within this very tight range it started back in 2022 going all the way to the ending of 2023 before it finally broke out of that range so all of this has been accumulation in chain link so yeah i would say that there's enough energy in the market for chain link for it to run to 25 30 dollars though but what we're going to do is since we suspect that price is breaking out in chain link we're going to identify some cell zones here's one okay here's another one and here's our last one our last cell zone so these are our newest targets now in chain link now we haven't been at this level in Chainlink since 2022. February 2022 price in Chainlink hasn't gone to like $20. It's been about two years. And now it's knocking on the door of those ranges of these cell zones. Okay. So. This is our newest buy zone there. And chain link. So we have our ideas. Let's go ahead and put this on a chart. Okay. Price buyers needs to hold this zone now in order for this price prediction to remain valid. Okay. Here's our first target, either at the low or the high of the market. At the high is 9%. Second target is going to be up here towards 21.53 to 20, almost $23. That's 28.29%. That's how high I'm taking the market right now. I'm not going to run to $25, $30 as Michael is on that article. Okay. Just going to do those two zones for the time being. Well, give me your thoughts, though. Yeah, I mean, the market is bullish. Here it is on the weekly chart. Okay, even on the weekly time frame, we're getting an indication of strength. We have two days and 12 hours. Two weeks still looks bullish there, too. Here it is on the three. Chain link on the five. I like the five weekly chart. But we still have two days and 12 hours, but that definitely looks bullish on a longer term chart, too. And here it is on the monthly. So, yeah, give me your thoughts. Make sure you maintain your profitability and as always, trade different.